Yo, it's about to be the sickest thing on the internet. Yeah. Welcome to episode two of Closing Time with the Broke Agent. Hey, I'd like to formally apologize for episode one on behalf of both of us for that monstrosity of bullshit that you watched for about three and a half minutes that had absolutely no direction. Yeah. We learned a lot. Yeah, we learned a lot. Hopefully you learned a lot about what not to do, what not to do on video blogging. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and now we're going to tell you what not to do on Instagram. Love it. Let's so get, number right one, into it. Cardinal Rule. Do not, I repeat, do not post a picture of your workspace. Wouldn't you agree, Wes? Um, yes. Elaborate I mean, on this a little bit. Okay, taking a photo of your workspace, whether it's a very strategically you know, placed flower yeah. and your journal and maybe having the MLS open in a tab, yeah. you know, saying, hey, I'm grinding. I'm your 35 followers don't give a shit about seeing what your workspace is. You know? You're not Andy Warhol. You're not creating a fantastic piece of art here. Basically yeah. all you did was put your Frappuccino in front of your iPod. Yeah. The second cardinal rule of Instagram of what not to do, do not post a high definition picture that you Google imaged with a motivational quote slapped across the middle of it. That's Wouldn't true. you agree? Yeah, I, you're my realtor. You're not my motivational coach. Exactly. Don't post that crap because the ones that usually post it are the most depressed. And it's usually me. <laughs> it's usually me. Exactly. <laughs> I've been there. I've been there. It's completely unoriginal. It, it Anybody, makes you feel better. Shut the hell up. Yes. It's completely unoriginal. Original. Nobody cares. Anyone can go on Google Images. Anyway, if you want to lose I, your I, followers, I agree. I agree. You want to yeah. lose your friends? Keep doing it. Third, do not post about how much you love being a real estate agent, shoving it down everyone's throat. You work your own hours. You know? Yeah. I mean, we, we get it. You don't have to lay across a couch at some listing that you saw on Caravan, and then yeah. Usually like, the ones the post, the post. Usually the ones that yeah, are, are posting, you know, like hey, uh, Caravan Day was successful. Uh, you know, have a good potential house for some clients. Uh, yeah. Are the ones that are doing the less, the the, the least business. I guess you could exactly. Say. Yeah, this type of picture is it's almost as useless as the fact of you going to that house in the first place. Yeah, because you have no clients. Exactly. So cut that shit out. Cut that shit out. Anyway. You're, uh, you're better off posting nothing than posting one of the first You're better ones. off just posting a picture of my ass. Here, this is the fourth one. Do not post a generic image or gift complaining about how real estate agents have to work on the weekends. I agree. I mean, how many times have we seen, woohoo, it's Friday, oh wait, I'm a realtor. It's like, shut the, shut the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is number said, one. Cardinal rule, do last. not do. Why don't you take it, Wes? Um, do not, I repeat, do not post an in-car selfie of yourself on the way to or from a showing or an open house with your douchebag chin strap beard, which I actually With some have. Oakleys. With some Oakleys, you know, with your face at like a 30 degree and angle. part of the caption with your saying, iPad in, on the grind. Saying that you're on the grind or that you're on your way to a showing. You're not on your way to a showing. You're in traffic stuck on the way to or, or from. Or coming from Burger King. From in and out Burger. I've been guilty of the first four. The last one, I would never do. But you do take selfies. Because anyway, avoid all of these do nots on Instagram, you will temporarily maintain some of your followers and hopefully some of your friends yeah, as well. Yeah, and if you have any other cardinal rules, definitely in the comment section below, leave them for us. Also in the comment section below, why don't you post what you want us to talk about next week because we have no clue. Here. We want to hear what you want to hear. Download also, and give it a thumbs up. Please. Please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe as even well. Even if you don't even like this, give it a thumbs give it up. A thumbs up. We'll, also, we'll send you a shirt. If you want to buy these shirts, you know, we got The weekend. we got this, BrokeAgentShop.com. They're 25 bucks a piece. We're actually losing money on every shirt we... Uh, but wh why are we doing this? It's for you. That's right. You know, we're, we're spending money it's on for shipping and everything. Exactly. It's, it's really a horrible Don't business. About it's it. a horrible business plan. You order it, but we're not worried. This whole monetization, forget about it, okay? If you want one of these shirts, we'll get it to you. They're so nice. They're not nipple rippling. They yeah, feel good. Yeah, that's exactly why I'm wearing one, because they feel so good. Yeah. Anyway, closing time, episode two. Thank yeah. you. Thank you.